In the name of Allah, the most beneficent and the most merciful. Dear viewers, Amreen Khalid here. Hope all of you are safe and sound. Today, I'll be telling you about the words used for daily life's phobias. So let's get started. First word is aerophobia. It is a fear of flying. My friend likes to travel by car as he suffers from aerophobia. Claustrophobia, fear of closed in spaces. My younger sister dislikes lifts as they give her claustrophobia. Emetophobia, fear of vomiting. His son suffers from emetophobia, which is a hindrance in his way to go on trips. Acrophobia, fear of heights. She always prefers to stay on ground floor in a hotel as she has acrophobia. Nyctophobia, fear of the dark. He avoids attending late night parties because he suffers from nyctophobia. Microphobia, fear of small things or germs. It is really very difficult to live with people who have microphobia. Monophobia, fear of being alone. She suffers from monophobia as she has lost her whole family in an accident. Pathophobia, fear of disease. She has made her life miserable because of pathophobia. Oclophobia, fear of crowds. His oclophobia makes him avoid birthday and wedding parties. Xenophobia, fear of strangers. He is a lonesome person because of his xenophobia. Amatophobia, fear of dust. Sometimes she becomes harsh with her family and maid because of her amatophobia. Chironophobia, fear of thunder. Whereas people enjoy rain, but because of his chironophobia, he remains indoors with his earplugs on. Pyrophobia, fear of fire. She is pyrophobic, that's why she never cooks. Nigophobia, fear of choking. She always seems lost because of her nigophobia. Astrapophobia, fear of lightning. He is astrapophobic, that's why never goes outside whenever there is a thunderstorm. Dear viewers, please share this video with your family, your friends, your classmates, your colleagues, if you liked it. Don't forget to subscribe to my YouTube channel. Hopefully, I'll see you soon in my next video.